I would like to hear you comment about Joe's evolution from the t first time you met him <laughs> to now, and and what you perceive as his we don't success secrets. What what is it that Joe has done um, that has allowed him to have this metamorphosis over? 17 years or so. Did you pay him for this? I did not. <laughs> well, he's actually a little less annoying. <laughs> you know, which is, which is, you just have to now use your imagination. Um, There's a ponytail. Hmm? There's a ponytail. Well, yeah, there was a ponytail. There, all of that's gone. And fortunately, he's not using one of those old men glue it on, you know, kind of. Well, you see bald guys, you know, with nothing but a ponytail. Yeah, it's a really good question, actually. Um, he, uh, well, first of all, he was, and I assume still is, a very serious student of the craft. And, you know, most, first, first of all, most business people uh, most entrepreneurs don't really recognize that their their whole thing is marketing. You know, they're in whatever business they're in, and they're they're sort of product centric or service centric. So they confuse they confuse the deliverables with the business. And so, going all the way back, a carpet cleaner would think he's in the carpet cleaning business, which that's a guarantee of low wage and you know all that. So he's always been a very, very serious student of the craft of marketing, as well as peripheral issues, personal development, you know, all of that. And most people are not serious students. They are they they want just enough to sort of get the money but not enough to really get good at it. So, you know, Joe became a professional practitioner of marketing and therefore can pretty much move largely to any business at any level. Um, I think also uh, far better than I, for example, he's, he's a big networking guy, so, which I am not. Uh, and so he's been very good at leveraging relationships. So I, I would give him that. But the serious student thing, see, very high level of curiosity, very high level of interest, willing to invest time and spend money in, in, in getting a piece of information here, a piece of information there, stitching it together, putting to work. I guess the third thing I would say is look at the longevity of key people around him, which is also unusual, you know. So the ability, I mean, so how long has Eunice been? 16 years she's been my sister. There you go. Yeah, yeah, and, and, and dog ears is, I'm sure, about right. Um, um, it just feels that long. Uh, uh, no, I mean, seriously. You know, stability of key people around you. Again, very few business people, you know, have that. They have sort of constant churn and trauma and drama and, you know, all that going on. So whatever that skill set is, pretty important. But I would say the biggest thing is just he's a very serious student. Not he acts unserious, right? But, he, but that's an act, you know, that's more than it is anything else. Um, uh, but, you know, he's always been a very, very serious student. 